hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel or if you're new hello my name is donna thank you very much for tuning in um if you're a subscriber already then thank you very much for coming back um as you can tell from the description this is a, another primark haul now the last primark haul primark haul i done was 10 days ago i believe but that one was the video was a couple of weeks old before i actually uploaded it um so yeah um it's gonna seem like it's quite close to my last primark call but that load of stuff i'd had for a few weeks and then i did the video this is the next lot of stuff that i've accumulated um i'm just going to show you so these are my bags um so each bag is a different time that i've been into primark so um it's accumulating there's stuff in there for my daughter that she wants there's stuff in there that's my partner's he wants and i'm like well I don't want you to have it until I've done the video. So I thought, right, going to do the video. I'm not feeling my greatest today. Um, I've just got out of the shower. Hair is still wet. Um, yeah, just having a bit of a low day today. Um, still not feeling great. Still signed off. So if you've seen my last few videos, you would probably know that I'm signed off sick. Um, not been working due to my anxiety issues. Um, still not great. Still not great um bit of, like i say a bit of a low one today um but this haul so badly needs doing i thought donna just do it so i'm gonna do this video so if i'm not my cheerful happy self i do apologize but this haul really needs doing so i will try to stay positive for you guys and um yeah i hope this is a good haul um so a wide range of stuff in this stuff there's stuff in this stuff in these bags um like i say some stuff for me for my partner for my daughter um i think there's a few housey bits so i'm just gonna dive in each bag and pull out bits to show you um yeah so i hope everybody's well um and um yeah again thank you very much for watching if you enjoy the video please give it a thumbs up because that really does mean a lot to me and if there's any newbies out there that are not subscribed i would love it if you would subscribe to my channel um right i think that's all the gump out the way um let's get into this haul so um which where shall i start i think i'll start with Oh, I don't know what bag to start with. Right, let's start with this one. Now, um, anything that I've got to try on, I will do at the end. So, um, I will show you what I've bought. But if you want to see it tried on, then you can stick around to the end and see it. But I will show you. So, I've got this top. This one was in the sale. It is just a very, very lightweight sky blue. It's cuffed at the sleeves. Um, and then it's just got this V um this one should have been 11 pounds and i got it in the sale for six um they didn't have it in a size 16 which is my size normally but because i've lost a little bit of weight i thought Do you know what it's quite big quite floaty i'm going to try the 14 because i really liked it so i've got that one yep. I'm pull the bag down here so it's easier to get to right next thing i got was a scarf um and now i just really like the softness of this scarf um yeah really soft um this one was five pound down to three pound and it's it's not like a um a thick heavyweight scarf um it can be used all year round because it is really soft so even on a cold day it is going to keep your neck nice and snug because of the really soft material but it's light enough that you could wear it you know in the spring and the autumn as well um love the colors and um yeah so i just got this one so really like that uh just a plain um now this isn't i wish they did this color in the slouchy range because this isn't the slouchy range this is just a stretch range of their vests um, and I don't actually own any of the stretchy ones. Um, so it's just a plain vest, but it's not got that um, oversized feel as what these are. These, this is um, a slouchy range vest, 
um and these are always limited in colors in primark so if i ever see a different color one i will pick it up but i really like the color of this gray but it was only in the stretch so um yeah and these are cheapest you know two pound fifty um and i wear these a lot it's like i live and die in these ones um i've got quite a few of these so uh so yes yeah, so i've got that one I've got myself some new knickers i just like these um because there is just nothing to, they're just nice and soft and no matter what clothes you wear i don't know what i was trying to say but no matter what clothes you wear you don't see these or you're not supposed to be able to see these pants underneath because they are so thin and there's no you know there's no hems to them no cuffs like on this bit um and because I wear a lot of lightwear trousers, i.e. like the ones I'm wearing today, just these, sometimes you can see my knick, there you go, you can see my knicker line. Um, so I just thought I'd try some of these and uh, see if that stops it. So these are three pairs for £5. I've got them in a size large. And um, yeah, so just three pairs of black pants. <coughs> right. I've got two lots of hairbands because I'm forever losing my hairbands. So these were just a pack of three for a pound. I know I always buy these ones because I just I love wearing the black ones. And then these ones were in the sale for 50p. Um, and it is just a nice purple one, which I thought would look quite nice in my hair. Um, and then a beige one and a blue one. So these were only 50p. Bag in. So I've got some hairbands. <clears throat> so I'm just going to have a slurp of my cup of tea. Oh, that hair. Oof. Right, so this is the last thing in this bag. Uh, just a jumper for my daughter. Uh, now, I got it in a size extra small, which is a size 6 to 8. My daughter is in a size 4 to 6. If they had the extra, extra small, I would have gone for that one. But my daughter does love her jumpers oversized anyway, so I thought she would probably like this one. And it was a bargain. It should have been £13, and I got it in the sale for three. So that is a bargain. And the neck is just, it's just like a flopping neck bit at the back. So from the front, it actually looks like it's got a hood, but it's not. And then it's got, it's got this little draw bit here. Um, there. And it's just, yeah, it's just a sweet jumper. So for three quid, I thought my daughter would like that one. So that is that. And that is that bag done. Next bag. Right, so this is something my partner need. My partner wears these for work. My partner's a painter and decorator. Yeah, a painter and decorator. Um, and he wears these for work. And... They don't last overly long because he's a painter. They get absolutely covered in paint. So within two, three months, they have to get thrown away. And then we just get a couple more. So um, this is the only one they had in a 2XL, which is a size that my partner likes to wear because he likes them oversized. He likes them baggy just so they're comfy for work. So we normally buy two at a time when we're going to buy them. Um, they're only £8, but like I say, they do him for work. So um, he's got another one of these hoodies for when he's doing outdoor jobs and it's a bit chilly. So I've got that one for my partner. Right, now these are the vests that I was telling you about. This is what I'm wearing right now. Um, but the ones I'm wearing right now are a size large. So I thought I would try. I have got a size large in there, I think. I bought two of them. But I thought I'd try a medium. Because I've lost a little bit of weight, I thought I would see how big the mediums were on me. Because these look quite big as well. So it's just a plain black vest. Um, it says two euros, but they're £1.80. And um, yeah. It's just a plain. It's exactly what I'm wearing right now. So there's that one. Now, out of the summer section, I've got this little romper. Now, I love a romper. And normally, I'm quite a dark colour person. I wear a lot of blacks um, and darks. 
but I really like the colours of this. Now, I don't know if it's going to clash with my hair because my hair is purple, but I've got it in a size 16 and it was £9, which is a bargain for a little outfit. And it is just this little romper. But I just thought the colours were pretty amazing. Um, so, yeah, I'll try that on at the end and uh, we'll see. Now, has it got adjustable straps? No, it doesn't. So I tend to, I can struggle sometimes with their straps. Sometimes they can hang quite low on me. They're too long. I haven't really got the boobs to fill them out. But we shall see. We'll see what this one looks like. So there's that one. Um, I've got my daughter a little dress. Um, which I think is very cute. And this was a bargain, £5 for a little summer dress for my daughter. So this is what it looks like. Um, it is the stretchy material at the back, so I know it will last her a couple of years. Um, and it's just, yeah, it's just a very sweet little dress. Now, they didn't have it. My daughter's 13 now, so I would have bought the 12 to 13, but they didn't have it. But because it's 11 to 12 years and it's stretchy and my daughter's quite dinky for a 13-year-old, I thought that would probably be okay on her. Um, so I got that for my daughter. Right, there's the other one that I said I got. And it's in a size large, which I also said. So I've got a large and a medium. Um, um, yeah, just another black vest top. got my daughter some leggings she wears these for school if she does PE if it's really really cold and she just also wears them when she's out playing they're only £2.80 these are the same sort of leggings that I wear as well they're just the most comfortable ones they do do a slightly cheaper brand for like £2.30 but the material is nowhere near as nice so for an extra 50p I just find these really really comfortable um, my daughter loves them as well so I get these in a two extra small because that is a size four to six and these are the ones that fit her so, some more leggings for my daughter. A uh, little pair of slippers. Oh, if I go that way, you can see them. Mickey Mouse ones. They are actually blue. They're looking a bit grey there, but they're like a bluey grey colour. Um, and these were £7 in the sale, for four, and I got them for £4. Um, and these I'm going to put back as a Christmas present because there's somebody in the family that I always buy slippers for every Christmas. So I thought, she likes Disney. They're in the sale. Buy them now, put them back for Christmas. So that is my plan for these ones. Very cute. And that is that plan done. So we are getting there. We are getting through it. Right. Next, I've got some clips for my daughter because my daughter likes wrapping her hair up with a clip. Um, so I just got a pack of two for two pounds. So there's a nice black one and then the that color there. <laughs> so just a pack of two clips. Now these were an absolute steal. Now when I bought them, I didn't know my partner was gonna like them or not, but they were so cheap, I just, I had to get a pair. Um, now these should have been 12 pound, as you can see. I got them in the sale for two pound. Now it is a pair of shorts. But, so that is what they're like. Now, my partner doesn't normally wear stuff like this. He's normally just a denim sort of, or like a car, um, not khaki. Well, yeah, he like, he's got khaki ones. Cargo style, that's what I was thinking, with the big pockets. Um, so he's normally like a denim or a khaki. I just said it again. Cargo short sort of person. But I thought for £2, and these are quite smart. So I just thought if we go anywhere um, out for the day, and it's really, really hot, and he wants to sort of wear shorts but look smart I just thought for two pound and they come with their own little belt as well which I don't know if he'll keep the belt with them but yeah they're his size and I just thought for two quid I was going to get them and he can try them on so um yeah bargain right another little underwear set um let's just it's just one of these comfortable ones. So it's very sheer. Um, there's no padding or nothing, as you can see. It's just a comfortable 
little set <clears throat> it is a thong which is not my favorite thing to wear but uh primark thongs are not too bad um so uh yeah but it's the bra i just thought the bra was lovely and this was in the sale from five pound down to three pound and um yeah just a little underwear set so that is that Woo. um i have been after a pair of these for bloody ages now um and it is these so these is a shape shaping seam free but they're their wet look leather look leggings so not wet look leather look um but i just find these I've bought their trousers in these versions before, but I find that when I walk in them, I sort of, you get this like squeakiness, like you can hear the material when you walk. Don't like that. So I thought because these are a bit thinner, but they still look like the leather look ones. Um, yeah, I just thought these might be a bit better. Now I did buy them in a size medium, 12 to 14, because when I, um, these not medium these are a size large but i bought them a few months back there was a pair in the sale but they only had them in a medium now my leggings that i always wear are a medium my normal leggings i always get them in a size medium because they just fit me that's the size i like so when i saw a pair of these in a medium i thought Do you know what i want to try them because i've been after a pair of these for ages oh my god couldn't even get them up over my bottom so they were way way too small um actually seeing them in there this time in my size which is a 14 to 16 um and as um well, i say my size i'm more of a 16 but yeah they were eight pound and i thought you know what i'm gonna give them a whirl so um yeah um i'm hoping they're gonna fit because if they don't i don't think it's the sort of thing you can bring back because you have to sort of tear you know tear the box to get into them and i don't think i could put them back once i take them out of the packet so I'm hoping they fit, but I've got a pair of them. Um, I needed some new dishcloths. Um, it's always good to change dish dishcloths every few months. And I just thought these were so damn cute. Um, they're the Minnie Mouse range, four microfiber cloths, and they were only two pounds. So I thought that was quite sweet. Um, so it's just four different ones um is there no there's nothing um each one is a like a different pattern I'm not showing you very well but um so they are slightly different but i just thought they were quite cheerful for a dishcloth um so yeah i knew i needed some new ones i normally just buy them from poundland cheap and cheerful they're like a quid for a three or whatever it is but i just thought for two pound it'd be nice to have some cheerful dishcloths very cute so um i've got them Now, this is really, really sweet. Look at this little love sign or love ornament. How cute is that? Now, this should have been £2.50. As you can see, I got it in the sale for a pound. And um, I'm just trying to take the sticker off. Yeah, I just thought it was really... It's quite a weighty piece. It is something that would just stand quite nice on a windowsill. Um, I've got a home one already on my windowsill. And I've got one that says relax. They're both wooden ones. Um, so I just thought this metal one was quite sweet. So for a pound, I just thought, yeah. Oh, there we go. Love. How sweet is that? So, um, yeah, I like that. Oh, another set of hairbands. Um, a pack of four. These ones were two pound. And, um, is it a pack of four? Oh, no, six pack. Because they're just the little ones. So, yeah, you've got two of each. You've got two of the red, two of the black, and then two of the grey and white ones. So, they're quite sweet. So, I've got plenty of hair bands now. Um, and then the last thing in this little bag was I collect shells. I live by the beach and I collect all different sorts of shells. And I just thought, if I don't use it as a vase, this would look quite cute with some shells in it. Um, and it was only a pound. It should have only been three pound anyway. But I got it in the sale for a pound, so I just thought I really like that. So I just thought for a pound, it would look quite cute with some shells in it. So that is my idea for that one. And that is the end of that bag. 
So we all get in there. We get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Right. Uh, another jumper for my partner. Now this is not a wet one. This is just a um, just a nice jumper. Again, he got it in a size two. Did he get it in a size two X? Yeah, it's a two X, and it's a Raiders one. Now this one was quite pricey for a jumper. I was quite surprised when it went through because he picked it up because he liked it. He doesn't normally come in Primark with me, but um, he actually came in with me on this occasion. And he really, he saw this and he was just like, that's a bit of me. I really want that jumper. So I was like, yeah, stick it in my basket. Um, and then when it went through and I saw it was 18 quid, I thought, wow, that's quite pricey for Primark for a jumper. I was expecting it to be like 10, 12 quid. Um, but he really liked it. And as long as it fits him nice, which I'm sure it will, because it's very, very oversized. Um, yeah. And it's a Raiders. So I suppose you're paying for the brand. If it was just one of their normal pictory ones you are looking at like 10 12 quid but because it's a branded jumper um nfl then yeah that's obviously where the money is so um but anyway yep yeah, got that so uh it's a jumper for him and then he also picked himself out a pair of jeans now these are his favorite jeans these are the ones that we buy every time we go in there when he needs jeans um, because he likes to stretch in them and 38 30 is the size that we always buy so we know they fit him we know that he likes these ones so um and he always gets them in they do a couple shades of blue ones they do the really light ones the mid blue and then they do a really dark dark blue but they also do them in black and they do them in gray as well so he's just got a nice selection of jeans um and it's just his ones like these we're getting a bit shitty looking he's been wearing them to do jobs on the car and his motorbike and yeah he just needed a nice clean pair again so uh we've got another pair of these so these are definitely tried and tested he loves these he loves the fact that they are stretchy and um yeah they're just ones like that what are they actually called relax straight stretch and these are only a tenner. That is a bargain. And these do look really nice on him. Um, so, um, yeah, he likes these jeans. So we stick to these jeans and then we just get the different colours. So a pair of jeans for him. Right, another little underwear set. Now this is another little loungy set. I like to wear these for bed. Um, this material because they're just really nice for sleeping in. So it is just this lilac and white. Um, it's not tie-dye because it's sort of like wavy sort of colours. Don't know if it yeah. So um but yeah, this was just this was a fiver for the set. Again, it is a thong one, uh, which my partner does like me in a thong more than I like me in a thong. Uh, not because of the way it makes me look, but because of the way they feel. I just prefer granny pants. Um, but, yeah, I do like sleeping in these. So, if they had this in a granny pants version of the knickers, I obviously would have got that. But I really like these. So, um, so yeah. So, I've got that little set. Um, where are we at? Now, I got this. I don't know what it's going to look like on. But I got this because it was only a pound. Now, I'm a sucker for a massive bargain. Um, it is a figure-hugging style dress. So, I really don't know how it's going to look on me. But for a pound, I couldn't leave it there. And it was a size 16. Now, I'm just going to hold it up first so you can see it. So, it is just... I don't know if it's if you're able to see yes yeah, so it's just one of them it is there's nothing you know revealing to it it is a high neck well not a high neck but a round neck top it's got the sleeves it's got the shoulder pads up the top and normally i'm not a massive fan of shoulder pads i have got to say but i just thought for an evening out it would look quite nice with a pair of tights and boots and maybe a little belt around the waist just to give it that something extra around the waist. But for a pound, I just thought I'm going to try that and see what I think. 
So um, so that is why I got that one. If it was normal price at a tenner, I probably wouldn't have even looked twice at it. Um, but that's a quite a good thing, see? That gets you out of your comfort zone. So I might try that on and like it. Um, but because, obviously, I never would have picked it up normal price, I wouldn't have known. So, yeah. Anyhow, next item is a pair of sandals. Now, these are another thing. If I had seen these normal price, I wouldn't have picked them up because I don't think they're the nicest pair of sandals, I've got to say. But they were £12 down to £4. I actually tried them on in the shop just to see what they felt like. And oh my gosh, they are so goddamn comfy. And I thought if we do anything, I'll go anywhere for a nice walk. And it's a really hot day. And I want to wear flip-flops, but I want a bit more support. These are going to be ideal for that because they are really comfy. And for £4. So again, if these were 12 quid, I probably wouldn't have looked at them twice. But the fact that they were down to £4 made me try them on. And I was amazed at how comfortable they were. So, um, yeah, I've got some walking sandals now. So I will only wear these if I'm out for the day. And I know I'm going to be doing some walking. And I don't really want to wear flip-flops. Um, but, yeah, I was just pleasantly surprised. So I got them. Uh, what else have I got on here? Oh, I've got a little nighty. Um... My partner spotted this one and he was like, oh, I really like that. And I was like, okay. Because um, like I say, normally I just wear underwear or these vests. I quite often wear these to bed with just a pair of knickers. Um, so, uh, yeah, he saw this. He liked it. So uh, in my basket it went. So it is just a little night dress uh, with these just lacy cup details. Um, this was £7. It's got the adjustable straps as well. So I know I can make it fit um to my breast size and um yeah just a little black sexy number right i'm sorry if you can hear that noise the bin lorry has literally just turned up outside my house i say bin lorry it's the recycling people which is why you can hear glass smashing and everything because they're picking up my recycling right last few items or last couple of items and they're the same it is just these face masks now, me and my daughter love using these. Um, so I've got two, so we could have one each. Um, we quite often have little pamper evenings where we just sit down and chill for half an hour together, um, put a face mask on, and we just chat and we just talk. And yeah, it's just a nice little minute, um, you know, a nice little, I don't know. We don't tend to sit down a lot and chat just me and her it's always like in passing or at meal times or this is just like mine and her moment so uh, i've got two of these and i just thought one evening we can have a nice little relaxing pamper session together um so yeah these are the ones i've got hydrating uh, we've used these before we do like these i do find they do leave my skin feeling really soft so yeah it's got them Right, let's try on some of these clothes because that is everything that I've showed you. I'm not going to bother trying the underwear on because I've got a few other bits of underwear from... I bought some underwear in Petco, which is Poundland. Um, so what I might do is do an underwear haul so I can just show you all the different underwear that I bought. Um, so those three underwear sets that I've just shown you from... Primark I'm just gonna keep back and um yeah I'll do a little underwear haul so uh, I'm not gonna bother trying them on but I am gonna try the clothes on so um yeah let's have a look let's see what I'm gonna try on first what have I got right so I've only got the four items to try on I'm not gonna bother trying on the vest because vests are vest just like this there's no point trying them on so, I'll do that one. So, I've got... I'll try the top on first. Which is just this one. Um, now, it's not going to go with the trousers that I'm wearing. This would definitely go with denim shorts or jeans. Um, is what I'm thinking for this. Or a little denim skirt. Um, 
I just don't know if it's going to fit because it's a size 14. But we're going to try. So, let's try it on. I don't think it's going to fit. I think I was wishful thinking. No, it is a bit snug. Don't know what was I thinking. Yes, I've lost a little bit of weight, but definitely not a dress size. I'll show you just so you can see what it looks like. Obviously, like I say, it doesn't go with these. Aladdin style trousers. Um, doesn't look too bad, but it's not comfy. Whoa, my bags. Oh, it's not bad. It is very see through as well. So um, I don't think I'm going to keep this one because it's just, yeah. Not keen on this one so this one is a no so that's going to be first thing to go back Ooh. okay all right what am i going to try on what am i oh let's do this little little night dress Let's just have a little look see at this, shall we? Yeah, I didn't work. Just tightening up the little straps because they are it's a bit saggy on the old boobage area. Just do this one as well. Now, obviously, you wouldn't wear this with a bra because it is for bed, but yeah, it's not bad. And have a look at myself in the mirror. Right, so that is it at the back. Yeah, sweet, and it's comfy. It's complete or oh, static there, and I just felt all oh, loads of static. Um, yeah, sweet. I like this next one let's try this one that i got for a pound this one i never would have looked at twice if it wasn't a pound um i still don't think i like it because it's going to be very it is a very clingy style dress um and I don't like showing off my belly bulges. And then I say that and I stand here with it all hanging out. Oh, hang on a minute. Shoulder pads are not where they're supposed to be. That's it. That's that one. That's that one. Do you know what? It doesn't look as bad. As I so yes, you can see this. But that was always going to be the issue because it is a bodycon style dress. But I don't think it looks too bad. So I'm just looking at myself in my mirror.
I do think with a little belt here, just to give it a little bit extra, so it's just not all black, but with a pair of boots, that's not a bad dress for a quid, you know. Or am I just deluding myself? I don't think it looks too bad. Obviously, I'd wear a pair of slimming pants just to help with the lumps and bumps. I know they don't get rid of it completely, but it just helps flatten it out a bit. But yeah, no, I like this. All right, now the one thing I really want to fit is this. Now, I really like this. And I never have much luck with the majority of their rompers that they do. I'm going to look at myself in the mirror in a minute. Oh, I don't know. No, I don't like it. Now, I would have loved it, or I would have liked it better if it had pockets, um, because I like anything to have pockets. And there's nothing. There's nowhere to put nothing. Um, so that is a damn point. But I just don't like it. I don't like the pattern like I thought I would. Um, I don't know way. I don't like the way it looks in this area. So um, this is another thing that's going to go back. Don't like it. <coughs> Um, last but not least, I'm going to try on my leggings. So, I'm going to take them out of the packet. And we're going to see if I can get into these. Mm, they still look a bit small, you know. The medium ones, I could not even get up over my bottom. So, right, let's put another top on. Oh, let's try on the size medium. Where is the medium? Here's the medium. Now, all of my ones like this I wear at the minute are a size large. So, I just thought I'd buy a medium to see. Right, I can definitely feel that it's a medium. Yeah, it is more skin tight. So I'm definitely going to stick to the large ones. I definitely prefer them better. Right, so that, sadly, is a no-go. I'm just going to sit down a minute. Ooh. Yeah, this definitely isn't a snug. But for things like dungarees and stuff like that, I think I would prefer the snugness of this to go with a pair of dungarees because you wouldn't see my belly. So I'm still going to keep this because I will get wear out of it. Um, right, leggings. This video is, whoa, 39 minutes long, guys. Um, I'm sorry. But we are on the last item. And if you stuck with me through this whole video, thank you very much. These are a no. Oh, no. How strange is that? In their normal leggings, I can wear a size medium. Because I find the large too big. These wet look leggings, I've got them in a size large, which I thought would be big enough. And I don't even think these are going to go up. Oh, okay. 
right so they're up i couldn't even get the other ones up this high but god they do feel tight but saying that now they're on they're actually really comfy Guys, I love them now they're on. Right, yes, I've got a camel toe. Um, so just ignore the camel toe. But I think with a nice long top, a smart long top, this is a nice going out pair of bottoms. I love them. Oh my gosh, oh, I'm so glad I got them. It was weird because when I had them to about here, I really didn't think I was going to get them up over my bum. Um, and that would have made me really sad. But they're on. And there is still a bit of room. And there's nothing worse than when you're out and about, things falling down all the time and you have to keep hooking them up. And, um, and I think because of the wide band, see that? That is a nice wide band. One, it helps me be all tucked in. But I'm hoping I won't have to keep hooking them up. Oh, I think these are my favourite purchase. Look. And you know when you get these in the trousers, I always find they ripple up under here. They're always really baggy. Oh, I like... I like them. God, look at my hair as it's drying it's just going crazy right that's it that's everything video is now nearly 42 minutes long so it's going to take a while to upload gizmo look at you and amongst all my shit on my bed look gizmo this is my baby boy oh baby hey baby boy this is my gorgeous little boy um yeah so i've got all that to sort out now but um thank you very much for watching and i will see you again very soon for another video thanks guys see you soon